Welcome back sa ating FB page na Free Reviewers Managed by Lunalin at sa ating YouTube channel na Solving Math with Lunalin. Now, let's answer question from random post at ito ay nakapost sa isa sa FB groups na lagi nating tinatambayan. Sagutan natin itong mga ganitong question, may mga percentage, percentage na yan kasi hindi yan nawawala sa mismong civil service exam. Now, the question is, in a class of, ito yung given na uh, Problem. In a class of 60 students, 20% are male and 75% of female passed an exam conducted for the whole class. What is the number of female students who passed the exam? Let's solve this in two ways. Doon muna tayo sa ating Kanto style way of solving. So, solution number one, dito tayo sa Kanto style way of solving. Ang total of students, 60 yan siya. So, 20% dyan. So, we have 20% of 60 and this will give us 12. Yan yung male. So, ngayon, si female, of course, kung 20% si male, si female naman ay... 80% or pwedeng 60 minus 12 and this will give us 48 or 80% of 60 that is 48. Now sa 48 na female, meron yang 75% na pumasa. Therefore, 75% of 48 and that is 36 what is the number of female students who passed the exam? The answer is 36. Now, let's do solution number two. 75% 75 of female. So, 75% of 80%. Saan galing yung 80%? Nasa given na yung, female, yung male daw ay 20% are male. So, therefore, yung kabuuan na 100%, yan yung 60. Yung kabuuan yan yung total ba sa lahat? So, 100 minus 20 and this is 80%. So, therefore, 80% are female. So, 75% of 80% of 60, kasi nga, 80% of 60 are female. So, 75% of 80% of 60 passed the exam. So, madali na natin itong gawan ng equation. Lahat ng of natin, multiplication yan siya. Passed the exam, equals yan siya. At ito na yung sagot. Kopyahin lang natin. Yung 75% or gawin na natin itong decimal. So, this is 0.75. Ito naman ay gawin na nating 0.8 tapos itong 60. Kayo na mag-multiply dyan. Ang sagot dito ay 36. So, yan na yung tamang sagot. Isa pang way sa pag-solve gamit ito mismo. So, instead na point 75, doon tayo sa 3 fourth fraction tayo. Next, i-multiply natin. Doon tayo sa 80%, sa fraction yan ay 4 over 5. Meron na tayong previous na video kung paano i-convert from, percent, from percentage to fraction or vice versa. So, i-multiply natin ito sa 60. Meron tayong 4 sa taas, 4 sa baba, i-cancel na natin yan. 60 divided by 5 and that is 12. So, ang natitira na lang natin itong 3. 3 times 12, this is 36. So, ito yung solution number 3 natin na fraction ang, itong, ang ating i-multiply. So, anyway, all I hope na meron kayong naintindihan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.